Hi everyone, today in front of me I have this Oppo Reno7 uh, smartphone and in this video I would like to show the best display settings that you can change on this device. So let's go ahead and start. First of all, uh, we'll open up the settings, go to the display and brightness section and here we have all the display settings that are present at this device. So firstly we are greeted with the opportunity to switch between light mode and dark mode. Very standard thing to have on basically any smartphone nowadays. Uh, below it we have the auto switch option that allows us to set some uh, custom schedule for the switch process between modes. So for example we can make so that uh, the phone and system will automatically switch to the dark mode from sunset to sunrise or set any custom schedule from one time period to another. Alright, so I'll just turn it off as for right now. Next we have the brightness setting uh, that allows us to regulate the brightness level of our display to make it brighter or not that bright. Next uh, it also has like the auto brightness switch which will uh, automatically regulate the brightness of your display in accordance with the ambient lighting that you have around you. Next uh, there is the screen color mode. That's basically the setting that allows us to choose, regulate, adjust and configure the color scheme of our interface. On top of this, uh, of, the, of the page, of the setting page, we have some pictures as for the preview. So we can see uh, what will the colors look like exactly once we make any uh, changes. There are like vivid and natural color presets, as you can see. And also the bar that allows us to uh, change the screen color temperature from cool to warm. I'll just leave it at the default value as for right now. Next we have the eye comfort mode, which once enabled filters out the excess uh, amounts of the blue light and makes everything look warmer. Uh, while this eye comfort mode is enabled, you can also choose it uh choose the black and white as for the display effect so that the interface on your smartphone will become black and white and also the setting allows us to set some schedule for its uh, automatic enablement uh, and there is another bar which allows us to regulate the warmness level all right so moving on to the next setting which is the video color enhancer that once enabled uh, makes the colors uh, at the videos that we'll be watching on this device makes those colors uh, more vivid makes those colors more lively and joyful so if you think that you could use this video color enhancer setting or option you can just go ahead and enable it next we have the auto rotate switch which once enabled uh, make sure that the layout of your phone are is being changed from horizontal to portrait mode and vice versa alongside with you rotating the phone physically then there is this auto screen off setting that uh, allows us to choose uh, after what amount of time um, the screen will automatically turn off uh, if it will be uh, at the idle status for well set amount of time throughout the values from 15 seconds to 30 minutes Next we have the screen refresh rate setting that allows us to change uh, the well refresh rate and the higher refresh rate we go for uh, the smoother and more beautiful animations and scrolling experience we'll get or if you decide to go with the lower refresh mode of 60 Hz we'll get the battery the better battery life and lastly, we have the screen display settings that allows us to uh, configure what will this top part of the screen of your display look like in apps. Uh, for example, the front camera layout display, we can change for each app separately and configure. And there is also an option to uh, configure the bottom part as well. All right, so that was it uh, for the display settings. And for this video in general so thank you so much for watching if you found this video helpful don't forget to leave your like comment and subscribe to our channel bye bye